just got the email from the WMBF um, about the details of the show um, and I'm extremely excited. It looks like that they're actually treating the amateurs just like professionals which just shows that it's a world level um, contest and competition. Any show that I've competed in the last 12 months, all the routines were 60 seconds. However, this time around I only have 30 seconds to get in my best poses and show my physique off to the best of my ability. So I'm absolutely buzzing, I can't wait. The nerves are kicking in a little bit, I'm not going to lie. Um, but no, it's just about getting my mind right, getting all the smaller, finer details in place, and um, getting ready for the next couple of weeks and getting ready for the big day. I need to order some new posing trunks. Ooh la la. Really? Not a hope in hell am I buying them. So yesterday I watched um, a feed on Instagram of a show that was on in the UK at the weekend. And when I was watching it I realised it was... Um, there was two competitors, I think I think it was two competitors that competed at the Worlds um, the show that I'm doing in a couple of weeks time last year and the year before and those two competitors actually won my class since then I can't stop comparing myself to them and now I'm question, questioning will I be ready for the show and it's really really freaking me out because in my head, I'm nowhere near as good as them. And it's really, really starting to frustrate me, you know. I'm trying my best not to think that way, but I can't help it. I do not want to stand on stage and look completely out of my depth and look like I don't want to be up there. So these little demons are creeping into my head, which is really, really freaking me out. So. I just need to I just need to stay on track and try my best try my best not to let these thoughts um dictate how I feel because it's very easy to do that and it's very very easy to get demotivated from it but I'll keep pushing on we'll keep striving to be better than what we were yesterday and that's all we can do but as of now I'm a little bit, just a little bit freaked out. afternoon and um, I had time to kind of get my head around this whole comparing myself to other people um, and being totally honest with you, like I always tell people never ever ever compare yourself to anybody else because you're not that person but I can't help it um, and I, it just takes me back to my first show last year where it took a lot of courage to sign up for the show because I was nervous of doing it and um, backstage pumping up I was fine they call my category to line up backstage just before we went on stage and all of a sudden my nerves just got the best of me I just freaked out and I'm thinking now, and the same thing 
is happening it's happening to me now three and a half weeks old from this show so I need to learn to relax and I need to learn to just trust the whole process that I'm doing and that I will be better than what I was from the last show and keep reminding myself I'm not competing against anybody else but me Friday morning and um, I'm actually up a kilo on the scales this morning the only thing that I can put it down to is that this week has been more structured with my food because I didn't have to travel to Dublin so not only have I been freaking out because I've been comparing myself to other people now I'm a little bit concerned about my weight in case I don't make the weight I know this vlog is supposed to be positivity and all of this stuff but I'm hoping that I can get this weight off and that I can kind of re restructure my mind and the way of thinking so that I'm not comparing myself to other people because at the end of the day I'm just putting on what stress on me and that's going to affect um, that's going to affect my end condition as well in a couple of weeks time. Let's go. Anytime I train, it always takes stress away because when you're training hard, you can't think about anything else but lifting that heavy weight. And it's after clearing my head already that fast, it works that good. And you know what? I'm doing everything I can. I can't do any more. I'm working as hard as I can. And I'm going to bring the best condition that I've ever brought to a stage in three weeks' time. Happy. 